Oh, thank you, Lenny. It has been such a fun Friday here at HSN. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Shannon Smith. and. Okay, this has been happening a lot to me in prime time, but it's a good thing. You know, we're home more, so we've been shopping earlier. So our today's special for all intents and purposes of this spring and outdoor event is gone-ish. Uh, okay, bronze only. And Jared, I don't know if we have any of the video on this or not, but yes, it looks pretty, you know, in the daylight and without any movement of wind, but boy, oh boy. This comes to life. Actually, I'm kind of surprised that we have the bronze remaining. That's actually my favorite color. So you can still grab a few, and I do mean a few of our today's special. Notice it has those illumination when it spins at night. So daytime, nighttime, this is gonna be a showstopper for sure. Definitely the where'd you get it piece in your neighborhood? Well, we've got lots of those planned for you over the course of this next two hours. I'm so excited to have you joining me. I'm Shannon here at HSN, and of course, we'd love to say hi to you. Um, it's funny because I was running a little late to work because, I, I, well, you know, I've been here for over almost 25 years and I'm friends with everybody in this show, but I was just chatting with everybody and we were all talking about what we're doing in our backyards. And, and in fact, we're getting all the whole family involved. In fact, if you've seen my friend Yvette Lopez, which I already congratulated her on her today's special. I want what she's having. I love your backyard, Yvette, but I have to say the camera work that your daughter has been doing has been stellar. She might have an, another job career or career path here at HSN, so look out. You don't have to worry about college or anything. We'll, we'll take her. We'll take her. <laughs> but Yvette, Thank you so again, much. congratulations again. And, you know, it's a shame that most of our today's specials are gone, but holy smoke, when you and I were chatting via text, this price is cuckoo kachu. It's actually even better than a today's special, in my own opinion, at $49.95. It's a three pay flex pay. Flex pay is open to anyone watching this show, $16.65. 90 day return policy. Yvette, I'm gonna pass the baton to you. We're still talking Ooh. about wind and weather, which right. e even if, we, if that were the whole story, they are a brand, they are a force to be reckoned with. It's so nice they do these things exclusively for us. Absolutely. You know what? I'm still standing here by the Today Special, but I'm going to move over to that plume spinner real quick. So just follow oh, me see, right on over. See, I should have strapped <laughs> my Fitbit onto you. Hey, by the way, as Yvette does that, remember, this day only, and you can probably guess, the price is only good for today. Um, uh, Jared is my producer. I just want to double check. Do we, ha we do have all the colors, correct? So we've got the green copper. Okay, you're looking at the multicolor. So that's the multicolor that you see on your screen. We also have a green copper, bronze, and is there also... Okay, multicolor and green copper, the two choices in availability. By the way, in terms of sizing, and Yvette's tall too. Yvette's like 5'6", I'm like 5'8". These are 75 yeah. and a quarter inches in height and then 24 inches in the length. Um, I can't transpose that into feet and inches, so I'll just go what's on my, my product information. Well, I, I feel like you should be covering some weather story here in Florida. I mean, you look like you're ready for action, Yvette. <laughs> you know what? T today has been a true wind and weather day all day long. But to the testament of their quality, right, we're out here in the elements, and this is what they do best, Shannon. They bring us these products that really make a statement in our yard. They're defining, they're like something that you would pick up at an art show, but yet the technology and the quality is what we're talking about. These are all powder coated, and they have a very sturdy pole that can go right in the yard as you see them here, or you can put them in a planner. So if you have limited space, you can decorate vertically with these as well. And you know what? What I think is pretty cool is if for some reason you did want that copper and verdigris, here it is in the plume spinner. If you want the multicolor, here it is in the plume spinner. So now we're giving you the opportunity to get home what maybe you missed earlier in the Today Special, or you could pick up the bronze and then maybe this multicolor one. Oh, girl, are you reading my mind? Am, am I that transparent? Because I was just gonna say, you gotta show, it's like love and marriage. Better Absolutely. than any of my marriages because the two shall not be separated. <laughs> 
they're gorgeous, don't they match? They're, they're they awesome. They do, but the, when I said wind and weather, we're so proud to have them here, here and you, of course, as a brand on HSN. They, they really are um, the leaders of the pack, so to speak. Yeah. And the price is one thing, but when you get them at home, Yes, we've, our crews have been doing an amazing job. Yvette, you and your, your daughter's name is Courtney, you said? Yeah, come here, Courtney. Okay. Come out here real quick. The camera, yeah, cam bring camera her woman because... Courtney. Uh, oh, I'm she's just gonna tell you. Oh my gosh. She, she's been behind the scenes all day long with the different lighting. It's a different element when you're outside. So she's been doing a great job. She's Thank you so doing much, an Courtney. an awesome <laughs> job. But you know, case in point, uh, I actually did a post on one of my Instagrams earlier today. I actually got soaked. There was a tornado warning earlier today. There was a lot of uh, rain. I mean, so listen, I might not hold up so good in inclement weather. These, I don't have to worry about, right? Yeah. They're not going anywhere. And again, remember, Wind and Weather's passion is to bring their customers something different, something unique, something that you can't just get at your neighbor home improvement store. So you're going to have something in your yard that is going to be the envy of the neighborhood with these spinners. And, and right now, I really want to take the opportunity to thank Wind and Weather for allowing me to represent them today because they are truly an amazing company. They are indeed. Hey, Yvette, I don't know if this is scheduled later on or not, but I can tell you for a fact, we've already sold hundreds of these. So hundreds of these already spoken for. Yeah. Uh, thank you again for the shot, guys. You can see, like love and marriage, at least some marriages, uh, these shall never be separated. <laughs> Go for that beautiful copper. That's what we have left in the Today's Special and just a handful of those. They m make beautiful bookend pieces or wonderful dimensional displays. One of the things that I love, and I, I boy, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm getting steps in just watching you, but when we were talking about the Today's Special earlier, and I just did it live here in the studio as well, the fact that there are two layers of, I guess for lack of a better term, animation, but then yes. it takes the weather vane to a whole new area. It, it becomes almost 3D in a way, doesn't it? Yes, watch what I'm doing right here. So the actual spinner head spins around. You can spin this around on the top, and then the blades, that, which actually look like beautiful feathers on a bird, <laughs> you know, that's why I guess it's the plume spinner, but they actually spin bi-directionally. So they spin in opposite directions and you get this mesmerizing optical illusion. And you know what, Shannon, that's what we need right now. We just need a little bit of optical illusion in our lives. <laughs> and like I've been, I've been saying this all day, we're, we're working at home, we're learning at home, we're cooking at home, we're eating at home. We have to play at home too and relax. So that space is so important to us right now. It, it absolutely is. Now, I, I think, Jared, the green copper is probably the most popular at this point. Okay. Okay, actually, they're selling evenly. So there's the green copper, works back beautifully to that bronze. And the multicolor is actually much more limited. There are 600 only there. I mean, that's like a little rainbow in action. I mean, it's almost hypnotic. Uh, I bet to me, and you know, we're, we're of the same age and generation. I don't know that kids yeah. even have these anymore. Do you remember those little kaleidoscopes? Kaleidoscopes, yes, I had one. See, that's exactly too. what, yep, yep. It exactly looks like a kaleidoscope. It really does. It even looks like um, stained glass. You know, it it's really, these are really, really gorgeous. And I want you to remember that because they're made for the elements, they're powder coated. So this isn't just a protective coat of paint. This is pigmented powder that is thermally bonded to the metal. That's heavy duty. That means these are not going to rust. They're not going to chip. They're not going to fade. You're gonna have them season after season, year after year. This is what Wind & Weather does for their customers. Okay, I've got the elephant in the room question. Are you ready? I'm ready. How complicated to put together? I assemble these. That should tell you a lot. <laughs> I'm not so good at assembling. But I'm gonna show you something right now. I'm gonna bend down and I wanna fold this up because you're gonna have, this pole has three pieces. This prong goes right in the ground, that stake. You feed this over it. This is what's gonna make it so sturdy in the ground. And then you just attach the spinner head to it. It really is gonna take you probably 10 minutes. You know what you need. You need a Phillips head screwdriver 
anybody can find that laying around the kitchen. <laughs> yeah, no <laughs> It's really easy to do. <laughs> well, and, and the big thing is they're they're pretty, they're wildly popular. Uh, hundreds of these gone in this selection. Now remember, we didn't, we don't have a lot of these just because, frankly, this is not s supposed to air, and it was not supposed to right. air for this price. I mean, that's what a this day only is. In fact, it's funny, um, even when I called uh, my sales manager earlier today, they actually still were, ho they, they actually thought I would be having the last airing of the today's special right now. So when I said yeah. kudos to you and, and wind and weather, you guys really <laughs> pulled out all the stops. Remember, we do have a few, and I do mean a few of that beautiful bronzy copper color. Works back beautifully to the green copper, of course. But it event, does. I, I, I think for a lot of us, and you know, we're all, as you said, we are obviously all spending more time at home. It, Absolutely. For me, I like a DIY project I can accomplish in minutes, not in days, <laughs> not in weeks. Listen, life is challenging. I've got enough chaos in my world. If I can get a box and know that I've done something just really great for my curb appeal, if nothing, yeah. just kind of visually soothing. It's like those little weather vanes or those little wind chimes that we used to have, right? You, you got it. And I, I want to tell you, the directions are so great that you will be able to put it together easily. You want to look for a spot in your yard. And what's great is that you can move it around. You glance outside. You see the, the spinner going. You can tell how breezy it is, how still it is. And for time right now, you know, I have a full house. My daughters are home. My husband's a first responder. We need that little break outside. We need that little mental escape. And you know what? These spinners really do give it to you. Um, I also want to remind everybody, since I'm a mom, Mother's Day is coming up fantastic gift for mom because every time she sees it she will think of you well and boy <laughs> Yvette you you nailed it because long after those flowers have died or weathered or <laughs> withered or whatever it might be which you know, let's be honest I mean a, a, a dozen roses is going to cost you more than our, our this day only problem is unless you're calling now now remember this is HSN I'm Shannon I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm Skyping with my dear friend Yvette for today's special for all intents and purposes sold out during this spring and home garden event that we're doing for today Today. What I do need to remind you is this was not suppo supposed to air. That's number one, because we were supposed to have the today special. This was not supposed to be this price. So time is of the essence. If you're able to grab it now, $16.65, that is your first flex payment. You can do PayPal, debit card, we'll zip it off to you. There's a 90 day return policy, which is amazing. You know, Avel, when I look at this, I think you really kind of hit the nail on the head. I mean, for mom, for Mother's Day, but even, you know, I, th I think of some of my friends, actually, Deb Byers, who's gonna be joining us via phone, um, she's been- so, Deb. She, I, I know, we love Deb. She got me in trouble, I, I was chitty chatting, I'm like, Deb, I gotta go, I gotta get to work. But she's been really self-sheltering, uh, and so if you've really been mindful of that, I had another girlfriend, she had twins, so she's really not experiencing the outdoor, yeah. you know, the rest of the world. This kind of yeah. brings the yeah. world to your doorstep in a way. You know, it really does. And, and to that note, I have a neighbor that has a sister that's a nurse, um, I believe, in, in Dallas. And she told me, you know what, Yvette, I'm going to send her one of the Today Special Spinners just to say thank you for being one of those essential workers out there. So, um, you know, these are just, they're really wonderful. You get a gift this at home. This, this is the gift that keeps on giving. It, it's not going to die. You don't have to water it. You assemble it in a few minutes, you find your spot, and, and you can even move it around. But I, I will tell you, you are, will definitely stand out in your neighborhood, and your neighbors are going to start asking about it. Where did you get that? <laughs> You're absolutely right, and especially at this price. And I'm, I'm going to pull out the, the farmer's daughter in me. You know, it, in, in farming, <laughs> it is important that you know how, how strong the wind is blowing and kind of what direction the wind is blowing. When I said earlier, this kind of takes the weather vane to a whole new area, gives you kind of an idea of what's going on in your great outdoors and looks pretty while it does it. Yeah, and you know, I have mine. If you if you can find a spot where you can see it from inside, it's really cool because you, I, I kind of walk to the kitchen, I'll glance out and I'll be like, oh, it's really breezy out there. I stop for a moment, I take a look at my spinner and I go about my day. It, it's pretty cool. And I'll tell you, in Florida, mine take a beating with sun and rain clearly, but you know, they just look as beautiful as ever. They haven't gotten snow yet, but I do know for a fact they look gorgeous in snow as well. So wherever you are, 
pick one up of these because you're going to enjoy it for seasons and seasons. I promise you that. <laughs> I, for sure. Well, Yvette, uh, thank you so much for joining us. I will see. I, I will see you next hour, right? I hope. Oh wait, this is. I'm just not a... sure. Oh. I think. I think this is the grand finale. That's what I think. Well, there you go. Just sell everything out and you I take know. your cute little weather jacket, your daughter, and ha ha mommy deserves a cocktail, okay? <laughs> I think so. That and a, that and a hot shower. Amen. But th thank you so much. I'm so glad I got to hang out with you tonight. I miss you guys over there. I really do. Can't wait till we get to hang out again together. Absolutely, Yvette. Thank you. Thanks to Courtney as well. Take good care and, of course, be safe. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Stay healthy. Stay safe. Yeah, indeed. Well, if you, uh, Yvette, of course, was also with Wind and Weather with our Today's Special, but you're like, wait a minute, it's only in the 7 o'clock hour Eastern time. Yeah, well, they're pretty much almost all gone. We have a handful of this beautiful bronzy copper color. That was actually my favorite. I'm kind of surprised we still have it remaining. And um, a little hard to see from this video, but I appreciate it. it. It also has lights. I know it says it in that top line graphic, but yeah, it's pretty during the day, but boy, when you see this come alive at night, it really is almost 3D, almost holographic. It is so cool. Well, I am having so much fun. We have all been shopping like mad. Are you having fun? I hope so, because this is HSN. It's a big day for us. It's our spring and home, our big garden event. And I feel like a lucky girl, not only because I have my dear friend, Deb Byers, who's joining us via phone, but we have something exclusively from Improvements that actually was on a little bit earlier in the year. Talk about putting a smile on your face, you know, turning lemons into lemonade. That's what I was doing when I got soaked earlier. If these don't make you smile, then I have no idea what to suggest because no kidding, from the cute little owl, oh my God, he's so adorable, to the turtle. Here's, Deb and I were talking about this earlier. Oh, how can you resist that hedgehog? And then, of course, we have uh, the bunny. Deb, all right, it's, it's so, it was so good to catch up. You, when we were talking about these earlier, it wasn't until I saw these in person. You're right, these just make you smile, don't they? They absolutely do. Aren't they just adorable? I, I, every single one of them has its own whimsy and its own charm, and they are going to be fabulous in your garden, whether in your home or outside. I just think they're going to be fabulous for anyone. Hey, Deb, let me ask you about, you know, the all-weather design. Now, on my card, it says like a poly uh, stone blend. Do I have to worry about any kind of... I see that we're, we've got um, potted plants in our, our little hedgehog. Is there any care consideration that I, I should keep in mind when I get these? Absolutely not. It's a poly resin and a stone powder. So they're really substantial, but they're not like uh, the concrete little planters that you need somebody to help you move, but they're going to be formidable. They're great for outside. Just let it rain. No worries. Or they're great for inside because they've got a plug that you can take out and leave them outside, fill it with soil and just let oh, it smart. drain or leave the plug in and bring it inside and keep it protected. But Either one, whichever one you choose, whether it's a bunny, the turtle, the hedgehog, or the wise old owl, they're going to be an absolutely gorgeous addition to your garden. You know what's so interesting, Deb, and, and you kind of nailed it in that description, because um, actually, I was, I was Deb and I were catching up on girl stuff, and I was talking about, you know, how hard it is to do my nails with my arthritis. Normally, I stray away from what looks like these heavy cast stone planters. So even when I picked it up, I'm like, oh! It looks like the real McCoy. It's, it's just a whole lot lighter and easier. Absolutely. And the great thing about them, Shannon, the one, the owl, is about nine inches high. He's about seven inches across. You can just go ahead and go to your home store and get an existing plant in a pot and just pop it in there. Oh, sure. Or you can go ahead and fill it with soil and put your plant in there and let it grow. And this would be a great gift for kids who are home. It's doing school at home. It's a great project for them to go ahead, put a plant in there or put seeds in there and let it grow and then watch it water it and care for it all season long. For sure. And even... Oh, oh, everybody's loving the turtle, Deb. That Aww. is so, see, we, we had bets on the hedgehog because we thought he was so <laughs> sweet. I don't know, I'm kind of liking the, the wise old owl. 
You know? I love the owl. I love the owl. He's awesome. But the hedgehog, I can't even. They're all the hedgehog, the bunny, and the turtle are all about 10 inches long and 5 inches high. And it's the owl that's taller. So he sort of stands a little head above. He but does. But look at the expressions on their faces, Shannon. They are so charming and so whimsical, aren't they? I know. They are so sweet. Look at that turtle. He is so fun. There's our little hedgehog. Uh, bunny, of course, if you're, especially if you're a bunny collector. The bunny always has a place in your garden, your rock gar garden, or, you know, even on your balcony or your porch. Deb, that's the other thing that I like about these. Um, even if you're challenged in terms of space, you've just got, you know, a small little seating area, apartment, condo, efficiency apartment. It's not like you need to have a whole field of flowers to appreciate these. That's absolutely true. They can be inside, put a plant in there, and enjoy them in your home. But another thing, too, Shannon, is, you know, we were, you and I were talking about the fact that we're social distancing. If you know someone who's staying home and, and definitely quarantining, you can send this to someone, send it to yourself, run to the home store, leave it on their front porch just to say, hey, I'm thinking of you. And then it's something that they can enjoy all the time. Because as we've discovered, these just make you smile and a great gift to give someone, particularly in these tough times. Absolutely. Deb, I'm just going to show everybody again that plug, which I, I think is important because um, actually, I, I, I know I told you earlier, I got soaked, you know, <laughs> trying to protect some things during the great outdoors. And if you don't have this, whether it's rain, sleet, or snow, just the addition of this I, I tell you for a fact, if this were real stone through and through, it looks like it, there's no way I could lift that up to even drain it if it had a drainage hole. Absolutely. That's what I wanted to say because they're made of that poly resin and the stone powder. So they've got heft to them, they do. but not so heavy that you're going to have a problem with them. So you can confidently leave them outside, confidently place them inside, but whichever one you choose of the four great little whimsical creatures, you're going to be ahead of the game because they are just that charming. Absolutely. Well, Deb, as they say, be safe out there. It was good to catch up. We'll have to do it without uh, official duties the next time, okay? I, I look forward to it, Shannon. You take care. <laughs> you too. Thank you, my friend. Uh, all right. Do keep calling. And, uh, uh, oh, by the way, also coming up, this is, of course, is our spring home and outdoor event here at HSN. I'm Shannon, and I, I just, it sounds like old home week. So uh, my Minnesota girl, Rebecca Wood, is coming up, I think, with the final quantities on the ice maker. This has been very, very popular. So, oh, is that it? Okay, this, well, I think I can pretty much safely say this will be your last airing for the season. So we've got 300 remaining, 200 in the black, and 100 only in that red. So, boy, I know Rebecca's gonna be coming up at the end of the hour, but I would, if you can, I would highly recommend that you pre-order on it if you can, 606-780. All right, we are moving along, and we have another brand that I absolutely love here at HSN, and normally I'm watching Guy in his garden show, or I'm, I'm texting her when she's on the air with another host because I'm shopping for things. There's nothing about leaf and petal or helping your garden grow that Rochelle doesn't know, and we're so proud to have them here. I think for a lot of us, Rochelle, and I said this earlier, you know, we're not all landscape designers, we're not all experts like you are, but you and <laughs> leaf and petal always make us feel empowered you give us the tools or the keys to the kingdom I, I always like to point out the little yes. brochure and and how these come you know packed and shipped and and protected everything is done with such care this is actually one of my favorites and the last time we were on the air I actually ordered this I actually ordered a couple of them because mm -hmm. I, I, and again I'll defer to the experts because I want to talk about not only uh the ginormity of it. Now it does come with a pretty good height. We've actually got one that's kind of exploded in time <laughs> here. Yes. But for $59.95, how easy is this? What do you like about it? Or for someone who's starting with kind of a puce thumb like me, <laughs> should I be afraid? Should I be very afraid? No, no, this is this is great. I have to admit when I got my own a couple weeks ago, because I'm up here in Boston and now we shipping all the plants up here because we can't have them down in the studio. I mean, I need them up here as well as down in the studio. So I have mine actually is right here. Um, and it's too tall really to kind of fit 
you know, in the whole screen thing here, but when I got it, it was, um, it was amazing actually, uh, cause I had never actually received it in the mail. I've seen them, uh, you know, a ton of times in the nursery and they're amazing in the nursery. Uh, but this is a, you know, this is about three and a half, four feet tall, right out of the box. And when you consider the box on top of that, I'm five foot 10. This box was almost as tall as me. It was so fun to kind of just figure out like, how am I going to open this box with this ginormous plant in it? Like how fun is that? Right. And that's just, um, you know, first year. So what you're looking at on set there right next to you is more about year three. Right. What you're going to want to do is, um, when you open it up is repot this in a bigger pot. And the reason you're going to want to do that is because this is something that's going to want to be watered regularly. You don't really want this to really dry out. You just want to keep it watered, keep it moist all the time. So in the smaller pot, I'm finding that that's like every second or third day, really. Uh, if you go into a bigger pot, you can uh, stretch that out. If you put it outside, you can stretch that out because you're going to get moisture from rain and whatever, too. Um, but basically, I mean, this comes, you, we get three plants, basically, and what we've, we've had our artisans braid them together. So that's how you're getting all of those colors. It's actually three different hibiscus braided together, yellow, pink, and red. And you get all of those blooms um, up top in just the most beautiful tree i mean it's 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 like look at that that's just yeah, gorgeous yeah. it's it's beautiful tropical tree i mean it's so fun Th this i'll tell you what is a little piece of paradise no matter if you're self-quarantining or you know whatever you might yeah. be doing in your backyard uh we do have the little comparison as rochelle like you said even when you first receive it it is it's substantial now remember is. this this is one that's you know gone through the aging process a little yeah. bit. Yeah, I mean, on set, it makes that one that you get in the mail look small, but I just want to tell you, yeah. this is not small. It's this not. is like four feet tall. I mean, I cannot fit this all on this uh, on the screen here. And I just want to point out too, when mine came out of the box, it had two blooms, it had a pink and yellow, and they come and go very quickly. But you look, you can see there's blooms constantly coming like uh, they're all over the place uh blooms everywhere and so you know it happens to not be in bloom today but it was in bloom yesterday and the day before it'll be in bloom again tomorrow um and this is just straight out of the box uh, you know a week ago which I, is I, insane it, it is and <laughs> Now, don't scold me because I haven't received my live version yet. I've actually spent more than this for a silk version in in the past. <laughs> I yeah. have. But, you know, but, when, yeah. when, when I said that you empower us, I'm really not kidding because not only you can see this little map, I mean, which, which, of course, Leaf and Petal always keeps in mind, but... I have to say, because I've, I've shopped f with you and for many of your items, uh, not just this year, but last That's year. Awesome. You, it's almost like gardening granimals, you know, it's, it's like gardening <laughs> gram, you know, for, for, for everyday folks, because we're not all a Rochelle. And I have to say the love, the care, the follow up that uh, there is nothing that you and your team don't think of. It's so impressive. Yeah. We really, really, really want you to be successful as a gardener. And so we're doing that in a few ways. We're doing that by picking plants that are easy to be successful with and that give you a lot of result for a minimal amount of effort. So things like this hibiscus tree, I mean, really you just need to repot it in something a little bit bigger. Uh, and, and by the way, I would say 12, 16 inches is where I would go with that. And then water it. That is it. You put it outside. If you're way up north like me, uh, you're going to want to bring it in in the winter. Um, a friend of mine, she's in Pennsylvania. She kept hers from last season all through the winter as a house plant, not a problem at all. It even blooms in the spring. It's fantastic as a house plant. And then put it right back outside on the patio come spring when, I mean, around here, I'm hoping like next week, week after something like that. Uh, but like, like we showed on the map there, um, I'm up in those northern zones in Boston. Uh, this will be shipping to you in a couple weeks if you're near me. Uh, but for most of the country, we're already shipping. Right. So you right. can uh, feel confident that you know, this plant is safe to put outside. It's safe to, uh, you know, you, this isn't going to take a frost. So if there's some freak frost coming, of course, bring it back in. But this is going to be a great plant. And for you down in Florida, all year round, you do not need to bring it indoors at all. This is fully hardy where you are. So up north, it's that outdoor patio plant slash house plant thing.
Um, but in, down south, you know, all the south outside. Uh, for sure. Okay. If, if I were a little more flexible, I would turn a cartwheel over this because I've seen you present <laughs> this with Guy. And I think, first of all, it's so pretty, but the... The, the, it's like an event plant. It like welcomes just not only all those beautiful creatures into our life, but it's a lot of bang for the buck as well. It is. And so we've, I've got two different choices here, right? Yes. So this is a butterfly bush, a budlia, we call it. And what's so fantastic about this particular budlia, both of these budlias, first of all, is the color. So if you've grown butterfly bush before, it's always a purple color. So and so are these. But one of these is much more of a rosy pink kind yeah. of purple. And then the other one, Dark Dynasty, is like this really gorgeous dark purple. Um, most budlias are kind of like a medium lavendery purple. And so these these two are really unique in that color, uh, which I really like. Um, very eye-catching. But what's even more exciting about them is the blooms are massive. So a normal Budlia would have maybe four or five inch blooms, you know, from top to bottom. These are like 10 inches long, which is really fantastic because it's going to just draw in the birds and the butterflies. And I got to tell you, the hummingbirds really love this, really love it. This is this and the Agastache that we have are the two things that draw my hummingbirds in. Um, but what's so amazing about this, this is one of my favorite things. I love things that smell good yes. in the garden. I am all about the smell. I mean, if honestly, I don't want to plant it if it doesn't have a smell. And these are so unique. There is nothing that smells like a butterfly bush in the garden. And you know what it smells like? It smells like honey. Like just the, mm. um, like, I mean, it's honey and it's like that. It's like thick honey and it's, um, it's super unique. You're not going to smell anything else like it. It's just this like unctuous, amazing smell. You immediately know what it is. You know why all of the pollinators are attracted to it because it just smells like that sugar sweet pollen that they want. It and, smells um, like happiness. It smells it like does. happy. It does. <gasps> Really nice. I mean, it smells like summer to me. Like it's it like does. this warm dog days of summer sort of smell. I just like imagine it with like the buzz of the insects around it. It's like, oh man, I'm home in my beautiful garden. It's it's great. It, it is. It's so nice um, the Dark Dynasty is uh, more of that purplish color, and the Prince. Yeah. Char are we calling it Prince Charming and more of that Prince rosy Char color? Yeah. I, I, <laughs> well, love you know. that. Hey, can you tell everybody about your food? Yeah, so uh, the leaf and petal, so these are so fantastic. I love how easy these are. I'm going to get mine down here. Okay. Um, they're like little dishwasher pods. And basically one of these, you take them out of the container. There's 50 in a box. One of these is for one gallon. So if you have a, a one gallon, like if you want to maybe recycle your um, milk carton or some milk container or something, rinse it out, fill it up with water, and then put one of these in. The uh, You can poke your finger through it if you want, but the little plastic around it will dissolve. And once it dissolves, you'll have this uh, fantastic plant food that the great thing about this is, is that it's really good for a broad range of uh, plants, which not all fertilizers are. It can get a little tricky when you're going with fertilizers. Some are very specialized. Some are very strong because they're specialized and you can actually burn your plants. Uh, but this is a nice broad range fertilizer that's good for edibles. So if you like ordered the tomatoes or something like that, yeah. they're good for that. They're good for your house plants. If you ordered some of the uh, aloe and different things that we've ha offered, or if you have your perennials outside, you can use it for that. So there's 50 of them in a box. Um, that's going to get you through the whole season. Mm -hmm. I, I, I use them like maybe once a week or every other week, you, you, you know, you really don't need to do a lot. Um, and it's just a good addition to really promote big, beautiful blooms, lots of foliage, great root growth, things that will get it established and happy in your garden. Absolutely. You know, this is something that if I weren't reading it for my car legal cards, I'd, I'd, I'd be dubious, but especially with plants, manufacturers one year limited warranty from the time of shipment. That's, that's kind of a drop the mic moment in terms of how Leaf and Petal supports what they do. They, they really yeah. do want to support you. And um, certainly I actually heard it on our, our, our sister network QVC where 
Alberti was talking about this is the year of the garden. And if there's ever been a time in history where those of us who have maybe been intimidated in the past or have been inspired in the, by, in the past, but I, we, there's this national movement toward nesting and really making our homes our castle. Yeah. And the truth is, Rochelle, I know one knows this better than you as a, an acclaimed landscape designer. Nothing does that better than plants. You know, you can no. paint, you can put pictures up, and, you know, and yes, we love our outdoor lighting, but boy, oh boy, a plant is what makes a house a home, isn't it? It does. It connects you to the earth. It connects you to growing and living things. And it connects you to that kind of propagation of something else and something new and fresh and connects you to another living being beyond yourself and other human beings about around you. And it is just so satisfying to take care of a plant, to see it thrive, to harvest from it, if that's what you're gonna do, um, to just see it be beautiful and be happy. Uh, I mean, genuinely, it's um, sometimes a challenge to figure out what this plant wants and how to make it happy, but that's part of the fun of it, truly. It's it's part of the fun of it. Um, you know what, Rochelle, if you could just uh, help me uh, differentiate, because again, you're the expert. Now we've got our choice. We've got the ruby slippers begonia and the yeah. silver treasures. Oh, wait. Now, I, I'm seeing some photos. I don't know if you can see those on your screen, but can yeah. you help me differentiate here? Yeah, so I, I want to hold up my ruby slippers. Okay. It looks a little bit different than yours. Um, and that the reason is because when they uh, when they get a little different lighting, like down in Florida where you are, sometimes that uh, light of the Florida intense sun um, can actually bleach out the leaves. These are intended to be house plants, largely. And in the house setting, you look at this leaf, it's just like blood red. So this is what the ruby slippers will look like. And they have these gorgeous undersides of their leaves too. This is what is so amazing about begonias. People are um, who love begonias are really collectors of them because they have such unique leaves. Um, these are just two fantastic varieties. Both of these are award winners. Uh, one for uh, the novelty of the leaf color and then the other for vigor and size and growth. Um, and so we've chosen these two. These are just really gorgeous, unique house plants. Um, you can put them out on your patio. Personally, I'm planning on putting mine uh, together in kind of a low flat container. I think they're going to look beautiful nice. like that. Um, so we get both. Uh, but I, I can see on the set, you can, yours are almost the same color. And that, yeah. I just got to say, that's because they, yeah, there you For go. You there can we see go. The red. And the red gets even redder as those leaves age. Um, so if you're interested in the red, I would highly recommend getting one of each because they are really different in, in um, you know, in, when they're grown under the right conditions, which is in your house. Uh, we, we store these and have them grown in a local nursery um, to Florida, and sometimes they just get too much sun, and so the right. red doesn't stay as red. Um, so the red is uh, truly actually my favorite because you just don't get this leaf very often. Uh, but the thing that people love about begonias is their leaves are really like little works of art. I mean, they have these little splash patterns of dark purple and red. And then the silver one, you know, is green, um, green in the centers with like this truly silver leaf. And then these red undersides, they're just, wow. uh, just really unique, beautiful plants. I will say these are ever so slightly more challenging um, if you're gonna be a grower only because uh, they really don't like to be overwatered. Um, but other than that, these are actually really nice, easy to grow begonias. I mean, begonias can, begonias have, have a, are notorious for being um, maybe tricky sometimes, but um, we've picked ones that make it easy for you. Um, and they're really, to me, they're very sophisticated. I, I love them for that. When you see a begonia, oftentimes uh, people will display them in their houses as kind of a focal point, like on a pedestal. Sure, they're absolutely. They're really beautiful. They're kind of like little pieces of art. So they um, are indeed. gorgeous house plants. Well, Rochelle, time is always too short with you. I could, I could talk for hours. By the way, I'm thinking of doing a greenhouse on my patio. So now that you're in my oh. phone, I might be picking uh -huh. your brain. Yeah, no problem. All right. Yeah, we can go in your greenhouse. Oh, actually, I think I might. Rochelle, I think thank you. Good, good to see You're you welcome. as always. Thank you, my friend. You
Uh, well, of course, you know, our hearts go out to everyone who's been impacted by COVID-19. And we know it's easy to feel helpless like this, but of course there are ways to help. And you know America's kids need us. With schools and workplaces closing nationwide, vulnerable kids are losing school meals they depend on, and low-income families are struggling with lost wages. Seniors are the greatest risk amid COVID-19, and local Meals on Wheels programs are on the front lines every day, focused on doing all that they can to keep older Americans safe and nourished. Well, at HSN, we're helping seniors and children get access access to food by matching customer and team member donations. And we're thrilled to share that we surpassed our goal of up to $1 million in total contributions to Meals on Wheels and No Kid Hungry. Thank you to you guys. Due to your overwhelming response, we're now actually increasing our matching donation up to $2 million. And you can help us get there. So if you'd like to donate, you can find out more information on hsn.com or use that item number on your screen. Thank you as always for your generosity. You know, together, keep saying we can make a difference. Well, we've got more with our spring home and garden event, boy, and the fun is just getting started. So how does your garden grow? We're gonna show you next. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. Juliana is for the confident, fashionable, amazing woman. She can expect to feel comfortable. She can also expect a lot of compliments. They'll be asking, who are you wearing? There's always a show behind the show. <laughs> Welcome into HSN. Great to have you here. I'm Shannon, and we are having an awesome day. When you're surrounded by all this beauty, I think, you know, Mother Earth is being bountiful. I, you know, she's taken a little bit of our burdens off us based on everything we've been going through. And perfect timing. Uh, I guess uh, the universe coincided because this is our spring and home and garden event. I have been shopping like mad, and boy, oh boy, sit back, kick back, relax. I promise we're gonna inspire you and find things to help your garden grow. And when I said, you know, carry, carry, quite contrary, not really, how does your garden grow? Well, it's gotta be with the famous spray and grow. And when I say the famous, now we know you go anywhere else. You're spending a lot more money than you're doing here. So we're doing the big one and the little one for no additional cost, which I can tell you basically for that feature price, that's normally what you'd be spending for like, I, I'd call it a home and away kit, but we're all just home <laughs> right now. $11.80 on FlexPay, 589133. Uh, Carrie, uh, by the way, your video was so cute. I wish I could show it to you. She, so instead of texting me back, uh, she did the politically correct thing. She just did a quick little video. I, it was, I, I should be playing it right now. But, no. <laughs> uh, but seriously, Carrie, when I said that Spray and Grow is famous, it's none of the nasties, but we know bigger is better. For someone who is not familiar with the product, I know a picture says a thousand words. We're seeing all of the beautiful results. Describe this for everybody, what it does, how it does, and what kind of things it's going to work on. Right, right. And so, by the way, I have to tell you, even when I was sitting here watching you with Rochelle, Shannon, I am loving seeing something even growing in you, this desire to garden. I think, like you said, we're all spending a lot of time at home right now. We are looking to surround ourselves with beautiful things because we might be missing what we thought was so beautiful in the past. Well, listen, if you have always wanted to plant something, maybe flowers, fruits, vegetables, herbs, even if you just wanted to have the prettiest lawn and you always thought, mm, I've got a brown thumb. Well, let me tell you, spray and grow is green thumb and a bottle. So it's not a fertilizer. And the truth is your plants do need fertilizer to really succeed. But what Bill Muskoff, who is the creator, he was both a chemist and a professional gardener, what he realized is these 17 micronutrients, which we call the vitamins for your plants, that's what's going to make the difference. 
it's a concentrate. So you're only going to use a little bit and it's going to last you for such a long time, especially with this awesome configuration we are giving you guys today. So here's how it works. You take two teaspoons and you mix it in with some warm water. You can use it in any sprayer, but we also have a sprayer you can use that we can talk about. And you spray it right on the plants, the leaves, the fruits, the vegetables. Remember, this is non-toxic. And it soaks in through the stomata. It's called foliar feeding. It's kind of like the pores of your skin. And it's going to give you more, bigger, and better. More fruits, more vegetables, bigger flowers, more buds, sweeter, tastier fruits and vegetables. Because what Bill realized was these vitamins for your plants, they bring your plants to their full potential. So how often do you use it? We recommend once about every two weeks. I use mine about once a week, but listen, I love it. You can't hurt your plants with it. Of course, it's non-toxic for you. Um, but honestly, I really feel like using it once a week works great for me. So basically what's happening is you're gonna be getting that 32 ounce for what we have always charged the 32 ounce for, but then we're also including the 16 ounce. So you might be able to keep one, maybe give one to a gardening friend of yours, maybe your mom, maybe your daughter. But Shannon, those pictures that our customers, thousands of customers sure. have sent in, they will tell you the story. Uh, they really will. Really easy, you just spray it right on your plants. That's the more, when we say more, bigger, better. For sure. Hey, more. Carrie, I'm just going to give a quick little quantity update here. I, yep. just, I hope this is your only show, because you only have 300 of these, so they're only... Oh, they're going to be gone. Oh, they're they're going to sure. be gone. So only 300 to go around. Remember, call it your home and away kit, your gifting kit, whatever it might be. These are actually photos from customers who have used it. You get a 90 day return policy on any of our items here at HSN. 589133. So whether you consider the 32 ounce, which incidentally I should point out, it's too bad we don't have a retail value because if you went to the Spray and Grow website, more than double what you're spending right now. And you know, you can do your homework, but I can tell you for a fact, they do things for us. They don't do for anyone else in the country and they are one of a kind. I take Andrew Lessman vitamins. To me, this is like my, you know, Andrew Lessman vitamins or nutrients for my garden. And, and, and Carrie, like you said, whether it's fruit or flowers or vegetables, I mean, basically um, whatever you got. Yeah, what we say is anything that's green and grows. And so you can put it on anything. If you have a patch of grass that isn't doing well, if you have a house plant and it was supposed to flower, but it's never really flowered and you're like, man, what am I doing wrong? Spray and grow will make the difference. And here's the thing. We guarantee it to the bottom of the bottle. You can use both of these bottles. And if they aren't giving you the results that you are seeing here in these pictures that Shannon is showing you, you can send it back way after the 90 days that HSN is giving you. No, no, Spray and Grow guarantees it to the bottom of the bottle. You can send the bottles back empty. Why can we do it? Because we know it works. It's scientifically proven. It's so easy to oh, use. Carrie, you just spray it. They, yes, ma'am. They love you and they love this because basically if we consider everyone who's placing their order, uh, they're the ones who get it. I don't know if we'll see this configuration back again. Oh, Carrie, I'm awesome so job. You guys are gonna love it. All of you who got it, congratulations. Thank you. Hey, I wanna do cash cab with you sometime. You're pretty good in that car. I bet you can carry a tune too. Don't you show, Shannon, don't you show anybody that video. <laughs> Your secrets are safe with me. Love you, Carrie, thank you. Love you. Take good care. All right, hey, if you were trying, oh, Jared, can I walk over there live? Oh, is that, is that okay? Do we have a camera over there or no? Uh-oh, okay. Tim, I'm sorry. He's like, that, I did, that, that, you know. See, I know they're, they, I strike fear and terror in the hearts of my darling crew because they're like, God gun it, that's Shannon. I never know what's gonna pop out of her mouth or where she's gonna run on the set or to the bathroom. So this is our This Day Only. And Jared, I think close to a thousand of these were spoken for in this show. 
Okay, over a thousand gone. That's almost a third of the quantity. And just so you realize, this was not supposed to air. This was not supposed to be on the air, let alone for this price. It's like a half off sale. So it, I eliminate the evidence. Price is only good now or as long as supplies last. Remember, interest-free payments. This is the multicolor and this is the green copper, which Jared, I think we have a handful of our today's specials. Um, Okay, we have a handful of our today's specials in this great kind of bronzy copper color. You can see how the green with the copper really work back beautifully together. Grab it, I would do it. Don't let it pass you by seriously because it's just, it's, it's almost holographic. It's almost like a, uh, a 3D visual. I mean, it's so super cool. Gosh, I love that price too. So hopefully you can grab yours, 682782. Uh, Jared, did, were you saying the multicolor was the most popular? Oh, wow. The, oh, you know what? By the way, there are only 100 remaining on that multicolor. So if you want that multicolor, 100 only of you can take advantage of it. Well, it's our spring, our home, our garden event here at HSN, our outdoor event. I'm Shannon, and I, everything has a 90-day return policy if you're new. We also have flex pay. Those are interest-free payments. So we're spending more time at home, let's be honest. And... Uh, it's funny, even my, um, my nine-year-old niece it, it does, of course, with kitty cocktails. I wanna make that verbal disclaimer right out of the gate, Rebecca Wood. I know she's from Minnesota and we hail from the same part of the world, so it's five o'clock somewhere in Minnesota. Uh, and even though my niece Lexi had her virtual happy hour with kitty cocktails uh -huh. at five o'clock, boy, oh boy, <laughs> if you wanna be the hit of your Zoom get together and then your Memorial Day and your 4th of July and your picnic and your backyard barbecue. And as we move forward and, and back and beyond social distancing, this, the sound of ice being made, Rebecca, is like a party waiting to happen, right? Music to your ears, isn't it? And it will, you'll hear that sound of ice being made every seven minutes with this ice maker. Can you believe that? That means this ice maker, this little tiny unit right here that only weighs about 18 pounds, it's portable. It is going to make 26 pounds, 26 pounds of ice, I should say, every 24 hours. Isn't that crazy? It and is. all you have to do is plug it in. It is. Hey, Rebecca, I'm just going to do a quick quantity update because we didn't get a chance to chat about this, but I think this is going to be your last airing. Jared, if it's okay, I'd love to show what we have left. Now, is it the black going to sell out first or no? Okay. The. Oh, gotcha. Okay, so the black which by the way is kind of like a, like a brushed hematite color. Our, our quote unquote stainless sold out earlier, but this would be a great alternative if you want to call it that. Cause like I said, it looks like a nice um, uh, hematite color. 200 only on the black and then 100 only on my, my sports car get arrested red. Uh, Rebecca, <laughs> let's take everybody on a tour of the details. So I'll, I'll kind of open and you've got everything going via Skype too. It. So it makes two sizes of ice. That's number yeah. one. How much ice and how fast again for everyone? When you plug this in, you are gonna start getting a full tray of ice every seven minutes. And you know what? That's every seven minutes, the best tasting ice you've ever had without a drain or a water line needed. Literally, it comes to you in the box, you pull it out, you plug it in. That's all you have to do. And it couldn't be more simple. I'm gonna kind of walk you through how simple it is because that's what I love about it. You don't have to sit and wait for ice. If you're still using this guy, and a lot of people are, if you live in a condo, if you live in an apartment, a dorm, maybe you have a, a bus or an RV, this old uh, relic that we all still kind of use and keep around, this is going to take you six hours. Six hours for a tray of ice. Your refrigerator ice maker is going to take three and a half hours. So. Six hours, three and a half hours, or seven minutes. And all you have to do is plug it in, remove that tray, put some ice right here. Oh, here's the sound of the ice being made. You hear that? Isn't wow. That Music. And then you replace the tray just like that and press on. That's all you have to do. And you're going to get that great tasting ice every seven minutes. In, in minutes, in minutes. Now, I always make the disclaimer, it's an ice maker, not an ice storer. So of course you wanna you know, put it in your great um, cooler or bag or your beverage. Let's talk about beverages. So why is it, I'm gonna say it's, okay, we've got one on large, one on small. Let me kind of show the two if I can. Why does it look like it does? And, and, and why, why two different sizes? 
You know, it's important to have those two different sizes. And what I love about it is improvements. I don't know if you've ever heard of improvements. We love to improve upon problems we all have, like running out of ice, and we improve upon our own products. So you get that small and the large. The large is important for your uh, mixed drinks, or maybe your iced tea, your lemonade, your water, drinks that you don't want to water down very quickly. You want it to take a long time uh, and enjoy that drink. The small is going to be perfect for your smoothies, for any of your um, blended drinks. That's going to be great because it grinds and bl blends to a creamy consistency. Both sizes, though, have that little indentation, and that's there for a lot of reasons. First of all, it's there because that's how it's made. They have stainless steel prongs that flash freeze it. So there's less impurities and that's why it tastes so good. But also that gives you more surface of the ice. So that means your drink is gonna cool down a lot faster, but because it's still one cube of ice or bullet of ice, it is going to melt lower. So they really put a lot of thought into even just how the ice is made. One of the improvements too, and I think you have it with you, is um, those re reusable water yes, bottles. thank you. Yep. We actually now fit our bullet ice into those, even the smallest of openings, that bullet ice is going to fit inside there. I, th I think that's brilliant. And I don't know if time permits or not, Rebecca, but uh, one of my favorite demonstrations on that bullet shape is genius for that, is the, <laughs> the famous blender smoothie dairy free. Yeah. And why is it when I put these in a smoothie or an iced coffee drink, why is it creamier? You know what? It's creamier because of that little indentation. It almost whips the air in there. Does that make sense? It, it kind does. of whips the air. And that's why you're going to swear that you've added some kind of yogurt or dairy or cream, anything like that. And it's going to taste like a sorbet or an ice cream. It's so good. Your best friend with the ice maker is going to be your Nutribullet right here. You're right here every morning. You can turn this on in seven minutes, get a full glass and tray of ice. Put your favorite frozen fruit in there. And I did this just for you. I feel bad I can't share. Uh, you just say it's five o'clock somewhere. So when I'm done here, I might add some coconut rum. But right now, you're all rubbing I have, it in, Rebecca. <laughs> I will. Three kids at home, homeschooling <laughs> and working from home. Definitely will. I have that frozen ice. And now I'm just going to have juice. So you can see there's no dairy whatsoever. Now I'm going to go and just hurry up in seconds. Going to make it look and taste like a blended. Uh, drink that you've added tons of dairy in. And Shannon, we are from Minnesota, so we know our dairy, right? <laughs> yes, we do. You're right. All right. So look, look at, at this. Look at, look at this. See, you can almost, gosh, it's it's not quite, quite like the milkshakes at the Minnesota State Fair. I mean, oh. <laughs> hard to top those, hard to top those, but it, it's going to fool your palate. I mean, that creaminess of that ice and like you really nailed it. I mean, the, the fact that it doesn't taste like frozen peas or frozen onions or whatever you have in the refrigerator or whatever you have in the freezer, it, let alone it makes it worth it. Anyone who tries this loves it. It's a huge customer pick. People just go bananas. Um, and Rebecca, this is our, would you say the profile is about the size of a bread box? Because we've had a couple of different versions of this one. That is, and this is the smallest footprint we've ever had. So again, we've even improved upon that because we heard from you. And everybody was telling us, hey, I'm taking this to my girlfriend's picnic. I'm taking it to um, my aunt's barbecue. I'm taking it tailgating. I'm taking it for weekends at the ball field. So it is the smallest footprint we've ever had. Great comparison is that bread box size. And it's only about 18 pounds. Oh, and wow. as long as you have that outlet, you can make ice. So if you're camping, uh, on your boat, on your RV. I even made it. This has come in handy now in two natural disasters, I guess. First of all, I don't have to go to the grocery store anymore. I don't have to go and worry about getting those bags of ice because I'm making my ice right here at home, which is wonderful. Sure. I never have to worry about running out of ice. And the other time was during the hurricane. I couldn't find ice anywhere. Here, I was able to plug it in and make it ice even in the back of my trunk because I had that little outlet, the, the adapter that I bought. I, I think it's genius. I'll just read off the official dimensions from our, our legal cards, and just in case people are taking note. But uh, 14 and, a qu and an eighth inches in the width, 12 and three quarters inches in the height, and then nine and a half inches in the length. And Rebecca, like you said, already eight, uh, only 18 pounds. Does come with that little ice scoop. So uh, Rebecca, just the, the Reader's Digest version or Cliff's Notes version, it's kind of plug and play. You, you, you yep. take it out of the box, you plug it in, and you basically dump the water in, right? That's it. Water reservoir is right here. It's going to hold about a gallon of water. So that means you don't have to babysit it. 
That means you can go and enjoy those parties, enjoy those get togethers. It does come with that scoop. So you can let people even serve themselves. And then the other really great thing too is all you do is press on, but it will tell you when the ice is full. So you can take it out, put it in an ice chest or the freezer, or it will tell you when that water is empty too and you need to add water. It tells you everything and no maintenance. There's no filters to clean. All you have to do is drain the water and wipe it out. I have no filter either, Rebecca. I scared my crew because uh, I actually am starting to take, I, ha I have so many products that I've purchased at HSN. I'm now going to take photographic evidence to show on the air because inevitably if we're Facebook and live, we're like, she says she has that. She has I'm going to test you do. <laughs> photographic evidence coming up. Got to make sure that I edit those photos before we show them on TV, but... <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> you look beautiful with no filter whatsoever. Well, thank you, my friend. Always good to have you here. I'm going to be sad to see this go, but we sure appreciate you for letting us uh, zoom in on your cocktail hour. You're going to love it. I'm going to go grab that coconut rum right now. <laughs> Rebecca, thank you. Take good care. All right. So if you are just joining us, thanks to my friend Rebecca. She is safer at home, of course, and hopefully you're getting your ice at home with the final quantities on that ice maker. Speaking of final quantities, I think Sarah has an airing of this later, but we sold a, a good chunk of what's available. Now, wind and weather, of course, they were responsible for today's special that for all intents and purposes is, is gone with the exception of this beautiful bronze and copper color. Now we have, so, oh, this, oh, this is the last airing. Oh, well, doggone it. I'd like to say that they saved the best for last, meaning me with the finale, but as we know, that probably wouldn't apply. <laughs> I sure feel like it though. So if you want our today's special, we have a few of those uh, to go around.